Hi. Okay. Hi. Hi. Uh, welcome to Casa de Lonely. <laughs> I'm your host. This guy. Um. Yeah. It's it's again. I listen. I realized. You know. After after that stream. Quote unquote stream. Like my my fucking left hand stopped working. I I don't know what the fuck's up with that. Okay. Listen. Just ask that. Listen, e Elon. Fix my VR headset. Okay. Elon, release a VR headset. Just do it. All right. After after that evidently two minute long fucking stream, I, listen. I, I didn't know I even got cut off. So I've. Yeah. Okay. Listen, people. If I get cut off, you gotta fucking tell me. Yeah, tell me these things. But then, great. It probably no one even watch that stream, so it doesn't fucking matter. All right. So we're we're back here in Casa de de Lonely. All right. Here we are. We we're back here again. You know, got a, my sock. My sock is still there. My pre-installed sock. You know. It's fine. It's 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 been slightly pre-used. All right. It's fine. It's maybe it's still warm. Who knows? You know. I I, I don't fucking know yet. I haven't I haven't gave it a check yet. Maybe I'll give it a sniff. Who knows? But yeah, we're we're back. You know. We got Sham Wow. Forget. Hey, we got air conditioning on. That good shit. So that's cool. All right. So we're back. <laughs> so, yeah. I. I'm fucking awkward. Leave me the fuck alone. All right. I I don't I don't know what I can say. But yeah, here we are. So. Let's see. Let's let's see if we're still fucking streaming. Let's let's just give it a little spot check. Yep, we're still streaming. I I, was, I got I got to check every once in a while. Okay, again, I will never know if your freaking cuts off. <laughs> so sorry about that. I like to apologize in advance. I want to go someplace. I want to see things. I want to do things. But I don't know where to go yet. Let's see. We got good old fashioned LeBlanc. Let's see if there's any good conversations down LeBlanc. Oh my. I just found out, I just got invited to a game, right? And it turns out that in the process of making an account on that particular game, I already made an account in that game. Yeah, brain injuries are fun. <laughs> I don't recommend them though. Oh, oh my. Let's see. Is he, oh, music. Bet you there's nobody here. Hi. Hello. Yeah. Uh, quite the friendly crowd we got going on here. <laughs> the uh, the hand sign gang. Okay, that's cool. I I can't see what you are. You're you're a quest person, so you probably see me as an anime girl. You're still loading in, by the way. Uh, let me let me see if I can switch to a quest friendly avatar. Uh, this thing. Oh, okay. You just loaded in. Okay, Maruki, uh, is that the is that the guy with the glasses? Because if that's the case, I listen. I haven't played this game, <laughs> so I I don't know. I, now I'm not loading in. Evidently, oh, I got the glitch. I probably got the goddamn glitch. It's fine. You'll probably load in. Just, just give it a minute to kick in. Well, how how are your how are your collective days? You know, I'm gonna load it in. Good. Oh, you just switch avatars. <laughs> you got a. I can't see you yet. Oh, you're both the same, the same dudo. I w I want to be this dudo. There. Now we look like a freaking barbershop choir. Or is it a quartet? Triquet? Is, is, is that a word for that? I don't know. Oh my God, wire. <laughs> Quiet, I don't know. <laughs> I mean, why not? Fair. Where's <laughs> <laughs> just put in the floor? I, I don't know. Let's see. Wait, wait, wait. Gestures. Avatar thing. 
Activate. Um, I don't even know what... Die? Here we go. <laughs> now we're sisters in arms. We're sisters in arms. <laughs> yeah, why not? <laughs> Alright, boys. boys. <laughs> so, um... Yeah. This is what we do of our time. You know, one of the most advanced nations in the world with you know some of the highest technology, and this is what we do with it. You know, we just lay back on the floor. Utopia. Like, I can't even be bothered to do this in real life. But in a video game, I'll certainly do it. You know, the whole press X to run kind of thing. <laughs> Lovely. Alright, I gotta stand up. <laughs> oh my, a backflip. I think I got one this guy. Hey, wait, let's turn the vanity wall on. I have one of this guy's avatars. What the fuck's this dude's name? I can't remember. <laughs> Amazing. I heard you play that song last time I was in here. That was like an hour and a half ago, actually. Two hours ago now. You must really enjoy that. I don't know gang signs very well. Wait, really? Yeah. That yeah, was so long ago. I don't remember. What do you mean? I, I, I'm, I'm sorry. I'm not in either the Crips or the Bloods. You know, I'm, I'm not into Street World. I don't, I don't have any colors. I, I understand I'm wearing a, a, a red jacket, but I'm, I'm not a Blood. Oh, so don't shoot me. <laughs> You're, uh, what's, what's that? Oh, he's, he's trying to say, hey, shorty. Oh, yeah. yeah. Hey, shorty, how you bit? <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. I, I've been short, I guess. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Amazing. Hi, Extreme. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I'm sorry, I couldn't handle a conversation about two dudes talking, talking about choking, choking people out. You got what? I might add like the orange justice to this Akihiko of mine. Oh. Like, just do this. Oh. <laughs> then you said uh, TBH. It sounded like you're seeing GHB or something like that. Is that to be honest? Yep. Isn't it just as fast as to say to be honest? Yeah, but I'm lazy. Oh, I don't. Okay. <laughs> it's like when people literally say LOL. Just to say, just laugh. You know, ha. Uh -huh. Yeah, uh -huh. yeah, that, 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 uh -huh. that's fair. Yeah, that's, I can do that. <laughs> I don't know, maybe just awkward. It just makes you feel more comfortable. You know, just to say, you know, hello or to be honest. You know, or t sorry, TBH. Hello, person from yesterday. Hello, person. Yesterday. Yes. So yeah, I had a lovely two-hour conversation today, so that was that was nice, you know, a coming of artistic minds, yes. you know. Did this person crush. Uh, maybe. Uh, did you draw me a wavy wang? Lovely. <laughs> like a, I I don't know. Let's see. <laughs> mm -hmm. Oh, hey. Hi. It oh, says thing. 69. Huh? 
All things. Uh, oh, no. oh, one second. Somebody's typing to me. Yo. Oh, hi. Thank you for the yo. Uh, I like your ribbons. Yeah. <laughs> but I feel like your ribbons have too many ribbons in it. Uh. <laughs> your your ribbon ends in three points. <laughs> or is there a fourth point? Oh. What's this thing? Oh, yeah, my thing. I, I mean, I don't mean to criticize. I mean, that's just what I see. You know what it looks like to me. I think it's going to plan, I guess you could say. I mean, for all I know, there could be a, a fourth know, ribbon hidden behind it. I'm on the way with the project. So, I guess the same thing's on schedule. I mean, it's your style, you know? It's like when uh, my art teachers yeah. would criticize me for drawing manga, you know? Oh, fuck. Or when my uh, parents or relatives would say, no, you shouldn't be learning freaking computer science. It's a waste of time. Computers, and the, it, computers will never take off, you know? <laughs> they never will. <laughs> you know, fucking jokes on you, Grandma. I'm a network engineer. <laughs> so, well, how's your day? Oh, just to proviso, I'm, I'm streaming. If it wasn't obvious, I have a damn camera out. It's not to take upskirt pictures. I mean, it could be. I don't know, Lee. No, it's not working. <laughs> Yeah, you can say hi to my one viewer who's in this room. <laughs> but you seem like a pretty hey. chill person. That's nice. Have you worked with Avatar 3.0? Well, I'm familiar with 3.0. What's up with the, the, the spate of freaking uh, mustaches I've been getting lately? I can only do... With 3.0, I can only do... That's the only thing I, know to do. I feel like some kind of robot dick. I to but I do wear glasses, so that's nice. Just not right now. Dang, you just said robot dick. I wanna... Uh, wait, let me focus on this. I it's really cool. want to, uh... Thank you. Is that what you were going for? Did I, did I preempt you? <laughs> I just... I, it had a really robotic feel to it. Make... Or, what sorry, Dr. Robot? Eggman. Put persona on it. <laughs> uh, okay. Let's see. Man, I'm actually put emotes and expressions on the avatar. I guess that's my next goal is the fucking deep one out shit. Oh, I know how to do the expressions. <laughs> Some kind of doe creature. Nice. Yeah, just expressions. It's very dad bod. <laughs> Crazy, we change your eye color, change your hair looks, anything like that. I don't forget it. Hmm. Uh... My. Hmm. I see. And I don't think you have to. Huh? Here we go. Look, America. Go ahead. We're just talking about. Look at this. Look at this uh, wonder. This this work of art. I wish I could screenshot, but I don't have that camera out. They should let me have both. Wouldn't that be amazing? Just give me both. Why can't I point? I have no idea why I can't. Really? I think I just need to reset my software. Four fucking skeletons. And furries. Four furries. Four well. Nah. I'll be honest. So far, that's the best Sonic I've ever seen drawn in this game. I'm not even joking. That's 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 not a troll. That's not a that's not me being funny. That's so far that's the best Sonic I've seen yet. <laughs> yeah, it still is. <laughs> Congratulations, you've done the impossible. <laughs> Zeno has a uh has a uh, art degree, I can evidently. Draw, I can only draw Lego with one hand. I can't have two hands. It's gonna be one hand, or it's just gonna look sloppy mess. Oh, so you can't like wait? So wait, by one hand you mean just hand here? That's it. Nothing on the paper to keep it steady. Oh, uh, I don't know. It's e it's easier when you do it with one hand, and it has art. I thought you said act.
I need to get back into drawing again. Uh, well, it's fine. It's my forte. The only thing I can't create is shit. The only thing I can create is code. Even then, it's spaghetti code. Nice. Okay. Are you uh are you more of a visual communicator? You know, a uh, person who feels more comfortable communicating visually or via notes even. To uh, do you have some kind of auditory sensitivity? Or some kind of brain static even? Nope. You just want to? Maybe some kind of creative welling in you. You know, you or your parents are asleep. One of those things. You know. Is this what I'm thinking of? Mr. Dubs? Nope. I mean, I know people who almost exclusively communicate oh, through, via, via imagery. You know, uh, JK. <laughs> That's cool. I mean, there's different kinds of people, you know, and, you know, being that, you know, I'm interested in different kinds of people, so I question those kind of things, you know, just, uh, yeah. I mean, me, I'm, I'm almost 100% verbal. So I, I communicate mostly that way, you know, to the point I can I could barely read body language. Like, <laughs> I, I mostly get detected if you're a threat. That's about it when it comes to body language. I'm trying to make sure I say this right and not sound cringe. I've been trying to cut down on my ears it's... recently, and let's just say it's been working and in a bit a pain. It's hard because. Yeah. It's not like how it was back in high school. Back in high school, I used to go so long without eating. I was just accustomed to it. And I was like, feed me see more. Tired. It's because you're tired. Oh, that's fine. I get that. I mean, when I'm tired, freaking, yeah, I'm, I must talk like an idiot when I'm half asleep. I imagine. I get that. You know, when you write it out, it gives your brain a chance to, you know, double check. You know, I imagine that's the logic you're using. When you just talk, sometimes you talk fashion you think, you know, and just blurt out things. Mm. I mean, we've had uh, two million years to learn to, vis to communicate visually versus, you know, the, the, the shitty languages that we've developed in the last 12,000 years. Are they cats? <laughs> oh, it's a person. At first I thought it was two cats making out. <laughs> you know, here's their little ears, and there's their eyebrows, and their, you know, their cheek to cheek, and there's their little bodies, and there's a the little tail. That's why I saw I first. I did not see that man, to be honest. I did not see it. <laughs> <laughs> is, is it late for you, or are you just uh, one of those sleepy kind of people? See, that's, that's something I'm jealous. When it comes to my art, I can't do oh, SD stuff. I can't do cutesy. You know? I mostly could just do motion and proportional stuff. It's fucking cringe. Holy shit. That execution was terrible. <laughs> I, I take it you have shaggy hair or is shaggy hair just easier for you to draw? Short shaggy hair. It, it communicates that it's hair. But yeah. I get that. Yeah, we all try to draw, you know. We, 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 we tend to wear our bodies, our, our accoutrement, in a way that we find attractive. We tend, tend to draw things that we find attractive, at least imagine are attractive. Not. Hmm. Not blank it rain. Hair. It's not good? Yeah. You're not good at hair? Oh, oh, okay. I, it's, it, it, it comes and goes for me, you know? It's kind of just draw the motion, you know? You know what's hard for me? High and tights, fades, things like that. That's really hard for me. I haven't figured that one quite out yet, you know? Even in my 3D modeling, it's, I got a model I got made, and that's what's stopping me from uploading it, is I haven't quite figured out how to do a fade yet, you know? I mean... 
I got the douche bun and everything made. I just don't know how to do the fade. You know, and that's that's in 3D, which is significantly easier to do in 2D. I don't know. I'm thinking about investing in one of those dig digitizers, those uh, graphics tablets with the uh, LCD, or what are they called, the touch panels? I want one of those. I mean, I got plenty of the old-fashioned ones, but I can't separate paper from pen, so I can't do separate like that. It's not way my brain works. I guess I'm too old-fashioned. <laughs> same yeah well i've been looking into a one by a company called shoot this xp pen obviously i've seen some of their 12 inch tablets go for about in the 300 dollars range depending on where you get it. but there's another one i've seen and it's not as good like the the screen parallax is a little much and it's a little lacking on features like it doesn't have all the nice little touch buttons on the side if you know what i mean and I've seen them go for about 250 you know. But if it works, it works. I mean, surely a, even a cheap Chinese knockoff tablet is better than the tablets we had back in the freaking 90s or in the early aughts, you know. So it can't be that bad. I mean, it might help me with my blender work, you know. I've seen people, you know, dual wield. And, you know, if it would be nice to have one of the wireless tablets so I could just lay on my, you know, lay on my couch you know, or hell, even on my bed and just work like that. But I think it would be more better for the work I do because I work in Blender is to just have one that hooks it to my computer, you know, with those, those display tablets, you know. But they are expensive. Same? <laughs> yeah, yeah. So I might end up looking into a cheap Chinese tablet. But at the same time, I could just get a vintage Centic. Like, I, see, I saw one on eBay a couple of months ago. This is one of the Square original Syntax with the still VGA. I was thinking about getting one of those. I mean, again, do I really need, you know, 8,000 levels of sensitivity? You know? I mean, I imagine I wouldn't. Oh, am I, am I in the way of your mirror? I, I, I keep this thing turned off. Well, if you get one, you know, I, I hope it works out for you. I hope it's worth the investment. You know, I'm, I, I got the money to spend on it, but, you know, and I, I, in my case, I would share it with two people, but I don't know. You plan to. Oh, okay. It's like I, I, I kind of wanted to take that money and spend it on a GPU, but that, that's kind of out of the picture. Even if I did have, even if I was a multimillionaire, I wouldn't buy a GPU now. Unless I was really desperate. So, I mean, it's, I, I kind of just rather just buy new tires for my truck right now, actually, versus spending $200 on that. I mean, again, it's not going to break the bank for me, but I'm not dumb. I'd like to save my money, you know, whenever possible. It's just, it's not something I really need. <laughs> you like drawing something on me? I'm trying to stay as still as I can, which is really hard for me to do, by the way. <laughs> Just tell me when you're done. Oh, I crashed. I crashed. I. What happened? Am I still streaming? Yeah, I am. <laughs> I, I literally don't know what happened. That person's interesting. I like talking to them. Or talking at them. I, I, I don't know. Did y'all crash? I, I guess. I wonder what happened. It happened to everybody. Th th thank you. Well, me and the extreme didn't get affected. Um, I don't know. Did we all kick you back? I mean... I don't know. 
maybe it's just a local thing. Like, I don't know. Maybe we're off the same freaking uh, telecom, you know? <laughs> telecom? Oh, I'm sorry. I haven't heard that in so long. I don't even know what that is. We still use oh, telecom. Still the word for it. Telecom telecommun tele telecommunications. We we still have telecom centers. It just doesn't mean telephone as much anymore because you know all all our telephone is digital telephony. I mean, hell, we still have POTS networks though, but they're all freaking digital. Even my I got I got a I got a pulse dial phone. You know the you know the ones you stick the finger in the hole and you rotate the 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 circle. I still have one of those, and it still works because we use a POTS network that's still compatible with with uh, Pulse and freaking with uh, Tone, which is the push button ones. But it's still digital on the other side, so yeah. Sorry, I, I crashed. I guess. <laughs> yeah. I'm thinking about hooking it up again. Like, I feel like my knees are bending wrong. Fine. <laughs> are y'all uh, fine? I lit a bit. I don't know. I mean, I could work so, out a little more. <laughs> going to sleep. You enjoy, okay? Sleep. Nice talking to you. Adios. You're well. Later. Yeah, enjoy your time. Trying to get too much bedhead. Okay. I tell you what, I get bad bedhead. I, I ate like three cookies. It was so good. Three cookies. Three cookies. It was a uh, small a truck of two cookies. Came out amazing. And fresh in the oven. Ah, uh, I see. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I can actually eat baked cookies. I generally don't eat uh, candy and you know pastries or whatever. I think, yeah, I just don't. I I just prefer to get protein in me. Fat, protein, a little bit of carbs. I see. It's just a personal mm. preference. You know, I like I like nice full meals Maybe versus like baked thing. goods. It is. Well, I hope it's a good thing. That's why I do it. <laughs> yeah, it's a good thing. See, saying you like protein in this avatar, it makes it a lot funnier. <laughs> is, is that a fact? Oh, oh, this is the guy that works out. This is the boxer guy. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, yeah. Yes. I mean... I, I, I just got some new cans of freaking protein, you know, but I, I'm not, I, I kind of stopped working out, so I can't justify eating it, you know. I, I My body got bored. All I could find were, I can't find more heavier weights, and every time I go to the stores around me, I, somebody bought all the weights. I'm not joking. They're gone. Also, all I have are 20-pound weights. Like, I even re go into the thrift stores, I can't find weights. It's It's so weird. I mean... Yeah. All I have are freaking 40 pounds of weights on my dumbbells. That's all I have. And my body just got bored of it. And I, I, I think I'm just losing muscle mass now. So I can't just... I can't. It won't do me any good. You know? I mean, I, w I went and freaking picked them up yesterday. They don't feel any heavier. So, I don't know. I've lost muscle mass, but I don't feel like, you know, I lost any strength. So I can't justify eating the goddamn protein I have. So, but whatever. Yeah, but I, if, I, if I eat Anything, you know, any calories in me, I prefer protein and fat. Gotta look good. <laughs> so, uh, what's, what's everybody been up to? <laughs> World Hoffman. World Hoffman. Yeah. Project. Project, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, you said you're uh, learning a program. You're learning the code. That's pretty cool. Is that a high school thing, or personal thing, or course thing, or are you going to college? Uh, college thing. College. Uh -huh, that's cool. Yeah, I I I got bored of programming. I it just bores me to tears. I it, last last time I wrote a freaking program was either in high school or middle school. I just I just I, it just bores me. I just don't have a head for it. You know. I, I can't even I can't even do web design. That's that's really boring to me. I'm not. I'm just. I just don't have an interest in. So I don't know if I even be good at it. 
probably terrible. See what you mean. I mean, I'd just I'd rather work on hardware. You know, it's something I could pick up and throw at somebody. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, like I I can like build a computer. I can like build the like like processes. I'll put a processor into a motherboard, but I won't be able to create a processor. Oh. I mean, yeah, these I'm days. Pretty sure, it's like. I mean, I I built one of my first computers out of a kit. You know, this was back when I was, uh, you know, a little knob. You know, but that's back when you can get away. I mean, you could still do that, by the way. I'm talking about a usable computer, though. Nowadays, it's like the 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 uh, hardware density is so much. Good luck. You know, it's like all surface mount technology, ball grid arrays. You gotta have. I can't even fix your Xbox anymore. It, it, listen, outside of cleaning, cleaning the cleaning the horse shit with freaking you know uh, contact cleaning fluid or alcohol, isopropyl, or you know trying to reball it, I can't. I can't do much more than that. Hi, uh, Moldy. Yeah, I can't even fix my my PlayStation. Although I just got a brand new one. I got one yeah. donated to me. It is gross. I got to take it all the way apart and clean it out. It, um... Yeah, well, yeah. I hope you don't run roaches. It, th that's exactly what I'm talking about. It's gross. It was... I, I, I left it in my house. I got, I got a spray. <laughs> I am fucking grossed out. <laughs> I got a fucking... Yeah, oh, God. I didn't yeah. sniff it. I I'm, my day's going good, by the way. Yeah. It's like my I, I had an original piano, piano black uh, PlayStation, you know the ones that could play, oh, play PlayStation oh, Two so games. Fuck. Yeah, yeah, thank you. Uh, yeah, but it died. It, I got I got the uh, what do they call it yellow yellow light of death or whatever it was, and I, I took my heat gun to it a couple times, and I got it to work for a while. Then it just died eventually again, you know, and so I just, like I said, I just had one given to me. I mean, I'm too cheap. I can't I can't go out and buy a new one. I, I just don't want to. But I, like I said, I left it in my house for a while, and I didn't take a look at it. And I opened it up, and yeah, it's full. Of I I hope all dead roaches. Oh my god, it fucking stinks too. I don't even want to turn it on. It's so fucking gross. How the f what kind of asshole gives somebody a piece of equipment and not tell them that hey, oh by the way, I have roaches. It's so freaking gross. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Well, uh, well, how's your day going, uh, Moldy? <laughs> like, oh, that's who was in my stream chat a few seconds ago. Tell him I didn't see it. I was too busy talking. Oh, that's awesome. I uh, didn't check that. Oh, is this one to your fans? Uh, as someone who came in to say hi. I didn't know this bit till now. Oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's, let's all say hi. Hey, there we go. Let's say hi together. Hi. Uh, my my hand's not working. Hello. Hi, I'm awkward. Hello. <laughs> okay, the quest user's gone, so I, I I feel like I could change back to my original avatar. I need I need to make a quest version of this thing, but I don't know. I can't be bothered. Yeah, it's all about <laughs> they say hi back. And no... I'm cool. Let's see. Oh shit! I gotta cook tomorrow. Yeah, you said baking. It just reminded me. I gotta cook. I'm gonna make nabe udon. Uh, yaki. Uh, nabe yaki udon. Oh, I gotta follow. Uh, I'm gonna presume that was you, Moldy. <laughs> yeah, it was. I actually had to physically look. Nice. Thank you. I I guess I guess you know. Th thank you for enjoying my shitty quality. <laughs> hey, they enjoy your shitty quality. Probably more than they enjoy mine, so yeah. Hey. Yeah, and you fix your audio too. That was nice. You know, you sound much more clear. You know. I mean, I don't know. I only watched a couple of your videos. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. What, what do you? What do you? What do you? What do you? What do you guys want to talk about? You want anything special? Uh, the, the sky. The sky. <laughs> That's freaking cloudy where I live. Oh no. Why <laughs> with a chance of meatballs? Hmm. 
I, I made some uh, meatballs, but that was like last year, last time I tried, you know, a recipe for meatballs, you know? I, I, I'm thinking about making a Chinese hot pot. You know, I got like the, uh, the hot, 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 the, uh, what's it called? The spicy recipe, you know, the soup, they call it, they call it a uh, soup bottle. So I got some of that and I got some fish balls and I got some, uh, some tempura, pre-made tempura rolls and some, some firm, uh, tofu. I got a bunch of shit and a bunch of vegetables. Uh, maybe I should make that tomorrow, but I, I, I I'm going to make, no, instead I'm just going to make a uh, Naviyaki udon. I, I finally got to a chance to go shopping at the Capitol, you know, where I live. So I went to the Asian market and I spent a good $400 in ingredients. What? That much for fucking pieces? Yeah, yeah. It's, it's not like you went super grocery shopping, bro. It's nothing. I mean, well, it's, it's like a, like a 300 mile drive for me. So, I mean, I'm going to spend a lot of money if I'm going to do that, right? I see. <laughs> I see. Okay, that makes sense. I mean, four hundred dollars. Oh, yeah, yeah. Geez. I mean, yeah. You said it was a big drive, so yeah. But then, like, he drove for three hundred miles. It's been four hundred bucks. I'm like, I hope you had enough gas money to get back. Oh, well, of course I did. You know, I mean, it was just it's just forty dollars of gas for me. Which I mean, granted, my truck's not that fuel efficient, but that's that translates to about forty dollars. Yeah, welcome back. I, I, I know. Are you guys the thing that shows up on your screen when you look down? You see your chat? Um, I got, uh, it's on my wrist. And I also got Discord on there too. Uh, yeah, and I got, uh, I got a, I have another app that makes noise so I know when I'm chatting, but that's not the app I'm looking at anymore. I'm changing apps, you know, because it was just a little too bit of a pain in the ass to use. I only use, I use an app called Chatty, and it makes the noise. So if you listen, you'll hear a click uh, typing noise every time somebody types, you know. And that's what that noise comes from. Because for some reason, OBS doesn't do it, but for it doesn't do it for uh, follows. So I use OBS to tell me that I got, I, it's it's a goddamn mess. <laughs> I just use streaming elements to get an overlay that plays notification. I I don't I don't know I. I just, whatever. Do you have to pay for that, or is it free? You just do whatever. Oh, no, it's free. Oh, okay. I mean, I kind of just keep setting up different setups, man. You know? What I have works. It also kind of allows me to keep track of what people wrote, in a way. You know? And it gives me some statistics on, you know, how long people are watching. Although, if somebody's ever watched me, and then they stop watching me, and it, it always says there's one. You know, so if there's two, and those two people leave, so no one's watching me, it still says one. So I don't know. It's not very good. It's, it's But it gives me a little bit of metric. I think that one represents you, because, like... Oh, it's it'll I, say I, zero I, if no one watches me. Yeah. I got one fucking... I'm watching your stream on my phone right now, anyway. Oh, cool. Thank you. Thank those, you. Uh, helping you with the agor algorithm. The twist algorithm. <laughs> yeah. I don't know. I mean... I just... I just need to be more consistent, and my life doesn't allow me to allow me to consistently stream. You know? It's just the way I live my life. Same. I mean... Like, it's a lot of I can do again, but like... <laughs> Growing up is a bitch. <laughs> well, I mean, it's I don't have parents to worry about. I mean, hopefully my parents will be dead at any minute. So, I mean, it's not that's not uh, my issue. I, I have adult issues, you know. <laughs> <laughs> and they become very non-optional. Trust me, you you'll you'll miss being a kid. That's the listen, listen. You'll miss I, being I'm freaking seventeen. Kid, Trust uh, me, when you turn eighteen. Your life's fucked. Yes, you will. you you will not be free. You'll never miss you 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 will always miss the freedom of being a child. I know I do. Yep. He's right. He's yeah. right. Yeah, it's mm -hmm. yeah. Dad Dad, I forget you're you're a slave driver. You're really, I can't wait to be an adult so I don't have to listen to anybody anymore. You ten years later has to pay taxes. Yeah. <laughs> 
yeah. mow the fucking lawn or the city will take your house away. Oh my fucking god. The joy of being a property owner. Um, really? Yeah. Oh my, that's so fucking... That's so, so annoying. That's so, I feel like, dude, it's my place. I pay I pay the taxes and shit to keep this place. I run this <laughs> fucking lawn now. I'll, I'll leave I, it. I'm well, if I want to. Okay, I, 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 I'm not. I'm not a complete anarchist. I'm a menarchist at worst, right? But the thing is, is like, if you say where I live, there are rattlesnakes. I have to mow my grass, by the way. My grass is unmowed, but I have to do it. I have to do it. It's not just because the city will do it, but let's just say, let's just say, I live in the middle of nowhere, right? Literally in the middle of nowhere. Like I lived out in the country, in an unincorporated area. If I don't mow the grass, that's rattlesnakes. Rattlesnakes can get in your house. I just saw a rattlesnake down the road. It's like the only thing stopping me from doing my grass beyond the fact that I don't want to fucking do it is time. I might have to even hire somebody. I don't trust the people around here. I don't trust a meth head for, you know, mowing my grass. They might walk away with my fucking electrical wiring in my house. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Granted, if I lived down the country, I'd just, you know, just, you know, shotgun, snake. You know, you do the math. <laughs> yeah, yeah, but you can't do that in the middle of a city. Oh, actually, you can. I just don't want to deal with it. The rich people where I live do it all the fucking time. You hear gunshots all the time. You can, but then the police want to know why. Exactly. I, and I think we just got cops again where I live. Police be like, why are you firing in 12 days? I just saw a fucking rattlesnake trying to come up in my crib. Yeah. I just don't want to be harassed. You know, I just want to be left alone. Is that so hard to ask? But the thing is, is me let my property go doesn't it bothers the other people. You know, same 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 with my neighbors. My neighbors let their property go. It would affect me in a way. So we do have to be good neighbors, but to what degree, I don't know. Like, say, like a, how a homeowners association insists that I got to keep my garage door open for some fucking reason, or I got to paint my house a certain color. No, I don't agree with things like that. But like house maintenance, yeah, I think I think a city can at least to a degree have a little bit of power of you. I'm again, I'm a minarchist, not a fucking anarchist. You know. <laughs> oh yeah, I got you on that. I mean, me personally. I just get a place where I don't even know who my neighbors are. If my I, neighbor can see what I'm doing from my backyard, from a window in their house, while I'm in my backyard, there's mm -hmm. a problem. I I miss that. That's why I I used to live in San Diego, right? I, you know, now I, I I live in a I live in the rural area. All right. These people know my name. I fucking hate that. I loved it. I was good with my neighbors, by the way. Like there was a lovely black couple that lived across the kind of catacorn to me. I have no idea. I, I, I've helped them move furniture, have no idea what names are, and I fucking liked it that way. But everybody in this town knows who I am. They call me by my first name, and that is so rude to me. It's so familial. I fucking hate that. Oh, shit. <laughs> yeah, it's a small area you live in, isn't it? Yeah. I grew up in a small myself. <laughs> It's it's and again I'm a redneck I I culturally identify as a redneck so it's not like I'm not familiar with this you know like I said you know I I I'm a, I'm a, I have the soul of a city boy and the body of a redneck you know so it's not, again I'm not I'm familiar with this this is not a new it's not culture shock for me I just fucking hate it you know but I at the same time I want my freedom I want to be able to shoot my twelve gauge whenever I want my fantasy. And I keep saying this over and over again, but this is me. My fantasy is to kick my trailer door open, let my dick swing in the wind, and shoot my fucking gun. That's all I want to be, is a redneck, a creature, a freaking force of nature. That's all I want to do. You know? Oh, God. Yeah, you'd fit in well in Tennessee, then. <laughs> Yeah, but things are changing in the country. People want to be up in everybody's business. City folk want, city folk want to be in our business because they're scared of us. Because they've been told their whole fucking lives to be scared of us. We got, they got nothing I want that I can't attain legally. That they don't want to fucking sell me, as it were. They got nothing I want to take from them. But we have everything they want. We have the resources. We have the food. We had the power generation. You know, all the wind power is coming from us. Their water comes from us. They want our water. They want our land. They want our votes, even. You know, they want our very souls. Yeah. 
city people are freaking greedy. You know, not all of them, obviously. Again, you know, I lived in cities, you know. But it's like they just, there's a fundamental misunderstanding. We understand them way better, maybe not culturally, but politically. We understand them in the country. We're all just a bunch of dumb rednecks, right? You know? But it's like we understand them much better than they understand us. And they, what's that? You don't, you fear what you don't understand? Well, they don't understand us. That's why they're so afraid of us. They don't understand. Why would, why would somebody need a gun? Well, it's like some of us are freaking ethnic minorities or religious minorities live in a community where freaking people still talk about killing us. So, yeah. Everyone should have a right to defend themselves. Exactly. Everyone. Not everyone. There's there's some people who shouldn't really, but for most people, everyone should have the rights to defend themselves. I think everybody That's should. How I feel about guns. You know, it's like it's like at best the cops are two hours away. It's like I don't even know when we got cops in town. We have to call the sheriff's department. No one calls the cops in town because we yeah, keep firing I'm sorry. them. Yeah, I'm sorry, but someone breaks in my house, I'll call the police, but I can't guarantee he won't be shot by the time they get here. <laughs> Damn. I can guarantee they won't have 12 stab wounds. They just got stabbed 37 times <laughs> in the chest. Nice. Exactly. I mean, Get there, freaking. I, oh, yeah, he's dead. Uh, oh, that's a great equalizer. Fast yeah, enough. He tried to kill me. It yeah. was him or me. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, man. And, and like, dude, it's called self defense officer. What? You wanted me to fucking die? Okay. <laughs> I'm dead. The guy gets away. Now, now what? Now like, my family's I'm, hurt. Everyone's hurt. Freaking. Uh, and all because you. You know, I couldn't defend myself because I had to wait for you. Well, it's like the th there's another factor that there's there's a political uh, establishment in this country that think they're a fucking resistance for some goddamn reason, even though they control our institutions, you know, and they have an extreme interest in me and freaking ostracizing me. They, 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 they want they want they care that I have an opinion. And even if I don't exercise those opinions, if you know what I mean, because my opinion doesn't agree with them, you know. Literal fucking persecution. If I bitch about it, I'm being a whiny bitch while they do the same damn thing. It's like, what? So it, it's it, they, they talk about re-educating us. Listen, I, 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 it's bad enough I live in a community where people think you think I'm bad because I don't believe in their freaking God, you know? But on the other side, but they, they're powerless. They're, 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 they've been neutered politically economically they've been there there are no effect to be worse is like one of them gets ballsy and decides to come into my house but i have fucking guns so i'm good to go you know yeah. <laughs> but it's like the other side on the other hand wants to freaking take the force of the entire united states you know all the cops they say they're fucking bad to freaking elect political and social change on me because i disagree with them they are a bigger city people are a much bigger threat to me than the common redneck is yeah. This is true. Uh, <laughs> these fake woke people and the fact that they control the money. And if they control the money, he who has the most money wins. <laughs> I yes, yeah, it. Well, I mean, it's a centralization of our economy, and and forget. Therefore, we centralize economy. You centralize political power. You know, and when you freaking disenfranchise workers, workers start to become socialists. Socialists ask for freaking violent social change, by the way. That's what socialism is all about. Just keep that in mind. Violent social change, you know, freaking murder the bourgeoisie, you know. <laughs> and in our, in our country, these dumbasses, the earth start over. these dumbasses don't just freaking lump in freaking uh, rich capitalists or rich venture. They don't freaking, George Bezos isn't the freaking bourgeoisie. They include, eventually they'll include freaking people like us. Farmers, you know, or country people. Yeah. It, you don't think it won't happen? Freaking ask the kulaks. <laughs> mm, that was a good point. <laughs> you have to understand history or we're doomed mm -hmm. to repeat it. Listen, yeah. when, when, when these people, these uh, left types, right? When they talk about workers, they're not talking about freaking some dude working a truck and tractor. They're not talking mechanic. They're talking, they're talking urban it's always urban. It's always urban people. You know? That's just how they roll. <laughs> I mean, listen, we're, we're talking about a group of people that will call me a fascist even though I'm neither a socialist nor do I believe in freaking, you know, group, uh, what's the word? Uh, group associations. How the fuck does that work? You know? I, I don't even understand it. Yeah, they'll try to make something out of nothing.
that's the way that they are. Yeah. It's a, it's amazing. I don't know. I mean, I, I am They're literally a liberal. I am a literal liberal in every sense of the word. I don't care. You want to fuck somebody? That's your business. You you want to be this? You want to wear, be a person in a dress? Not a dress? I don't give a fuck. I don't care. As long as you don't bother me and freaking bother mine. Leave people alone. But these people can't leave people alone. That's the fucking problem. You know? That's why I left the cities. They won't leave you. They won't leave me alone. And I went all the way over here. That's why. That's why it's like I don't like centralization of power, because uh, over here where I live, California shouldn't have as much control for me. But they think they should. They they want empire. They want empire. That at the same time, bitching about the freaking concept of the nation state. At the same time, building a strong centralized nation state. Yeah. Thanks. Stop it. Get some fucking help. <laughs> I just want to be left alone. Just li- listen. Just just leave me alone. It's okay. You know, you want me to you want me to call you what don't, you want. Don't fuck with me. Convince don't me. Fuck with my shit, and I won't fuck yeah. with you. I'm not, gonna, I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna listen. I'm not gonna. To... Just don't come in my property. Just staff my property. You have no reason to be here. Just stay away. Just go away. Unless I invite you over, don't come over. <laughs> Bingo. Oh, fuck, I think I fucking messed up. Nope, we're good. I don't know. That's Joy. Sorry for the politics, by the way, Moldy. I, I probably lost another viewer. <laughs> a lot of people hate politics. Hey. When you're a victim of politics, or perhaps even a perpetrator of politics, it becomes it becomes very important to you. You know what I mean? Sometimes you just can't help it. Let it out. You know? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. The, the personal becomes political, as they like to say. <laughs> what do I know? I'm just a goddamn dumb redneck. <laughs> I need better tracking. I, I kind of wish I'm starting to think that, uh, just a, just a mixed reality headset. I, I've, I've been looking at the deck of gear and I wasn't sure. And I kind of wish I invested in it now. I mean, it's just 400 something dollars, right? And if it's a scam, I can just get just my money back. Something dollars. Yeah. That's not, you don't have money. I mean, I got to spend $500 uh, in tires uh, in, in a week. Uh, let's see. I work. Okay, let's put it this way. I'm 28. I work in a warehouse from 4 o'clock in the afternoon all the way until 3 in the morning some days. So, mm-hmm. Nine hours a day. 550 bucks a week. Yeah, I make about 550 bucks a week on a good week mm-hmm. whenever I'm working at least 50 hours a week. And uh, uh, I pretty much make less than 2K in a month. Is it where you yeah, live? Is, is that that that, that a problem? Because that's actually pretty good pay where I live. Oh, really? I, well, I live in. That's Tennessee. actually above. I'm just learning the budgeting and stuff like. Oh. That and... That's that's a large. Pro- I I don't mean to say that a lot of people aren't economically uh, disenfranchised. You know, I'm talking about wage wise, you know, but a lot of it is like you're making plenty of money. Your problem is, is A, your budgeting, because you don't understand budget. That's a fundamental difference between rich people and poor people, by the way. Rich people spend money like poor people should. Rich people, uh, Poor people spend money like they think rich people do. You know, there's, there's, there's other factors, yeah. too. You know, it's not necessarily how smart you is, you know. I mean, there are plenty of dumb people yeah. who made it rich. And I don't mean like they inherited it from their daddy. I mean, like they themselves are the wealthy person, you know. I mean, yeah. yeah. It's like just fucking move. That's that's why I think you know. I'm, again, I, I'm I'm a minarchist, but I freaking I believe in problem problem solving. Is we should have national, federally insured movie insurance that we all pay for, all of us, all of us workers. That is, you know, and uh, so the federal government, mm-hmm. you know, will move you as long as you you are sponsored for a job in a different state, you know, whatever. The federal government will pay. You. That way, we can get people out of our inner cities where they're just living on welfare. Basically acting as freaking uh, vote slaves for the freaking Democrats. 
just pay people to move. Mm. I think I think it's I think it's I I think it's not necessarily a violation. It's not freaking necessarily welfare. And there's nothing wrong with a little bit of welfare. You're not making a dependent class. You're basically helping people along to become earners, to become, you know, component of our society. You know, it's okay. You, if you want to say it's anti-capitalist, I would argue the United States has never been a capitalist state. Ever. <laughs> We're a socialist state. We've been yeah, from the beginning. You know. Maybe on to something there. Yeah, yeah I, I, I would argue, just like if people say there's no such thing as capitalism or uh, communism, well, I argue there's never ever been such thing as capitalism. It's it's an ideal at best that you can achieve to. You know, we, we emulate it, but we, we're a socialist state. We've always been, you know. Socialism doesn't mean healthcare, by the way. It's just if we control the economy. The government, trust me, don't pay your taxes. See how fast the government will take your factory away. You're just renting it, really. My yep. property, I'm renting it, really. <laughs> You will always be renting it. <laughs> yeah, it's the question. Is the question is 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 how authoritarian are we? You know. Oh, welcome back. Yep. It's like, and I'm I'm definitely anti-authoritarian, but you know, sometimes we we you you some people are just bad neighbors. You know, you can't you can't rely on people being good neighbors all the time. You know, you're welcome. I'd rather just cut out the neighbor process altogether. I, if I don't we know who my neighbors are. I, I would, a big plot of land. If we, you know, we could almost do it. But I think, you know what, I think would solve a lot of economic problems in this country, right? Maybe, or at the very least, it would be an experiment. And maybe, maybe even a prestige project for our country. And then again, it might be a waste of our goddamn money. Is I need, I think that we need to, the government needs to take some of its federal land. It, it's prairie land, right? And it needs to take inner city people. I, w I would happily love inner city people to do this. And we need to build our colleges. Just a huge country. We start with like a thousand people building and then work our way up from there, you know. And then freaking e export the technology for money to other countries. We need to start working on our colleges, you know. <laughs> what is that face? Oh, yeah. Pigtails. I like it. I, I think I think that would one be a wonderful prestige project for our country. It'll, it'll help our national pride if you still believe in that. You know, a little bit of American exceptionalism. You know, it would be economic boom because we created an economic center in the middle of the country. You may say, well, there's nothing there. You, if you you can't you can't just build a city. Cities are built around you know economic resources like there's a harbor, a port, a fishery, a mine, a transportation route. No, we live. It's this is 2000 freaking 2021. 20, we have a digital economy now. There are artists. I'm a digital artist. You know? We've gone full digital. Yeah. Pretty much at this point. I mean, so we got streamers. We got people that can live in these 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 cities. So you can have economies everywhere. And then if you can you can build a service economy up around supporting those people. You know? Yep. I mean, you can get away with it, you know, and just build it on a transportation hub. It, it, it would be one of us. It would solve a lot of our inner city population problems. It, it would, more importantly, get minorities away from Democrats. You know? Mm -hmm. <laughs> I've, I've also argued that the mm -hmm. federal government should take some of its land and just whoever wants to, whoever signs it, we should have a program where the federal government goes, hey, this acre of land, we'll let you farm it. We'll, we'll even let you borrow the tractor and equipment to do it. You know, you should check it out. You know, again, this is extremely socialist. This is coming from a minarchist, but it, it's again, I'm a problem solver. You know, and in three years, if you if you come out with say three years worth of crops, and you can says the government just gives it to you, the government doesn't even t w w won't even tax you for it. It's literally just to you can become self sustaining. You know, problem is, is a program like that won't work because of people. <laughs> it's, it's one of the reasons I'm not a yeah, fucking socialist. People, people suck. Yeah, yeah. But, I mean, I, I do believe in giving people opportunities. I, I want our people to have opportunities, you know. I, I, I believe in our people, you know. Black, white, brown, yellow, freaking dress wear. It doesn't matter. I believe in us, you know. We just stopped believing. We, start, we, started, we started segregating ourselves. And we shouldn't do that. We're, we're, we're people. We're, we are a nation. It's the media. Yeah, it is. It's the media. I, I, John Mayer, if you trust the television, what you get is what you got. Because when they own the information, they can bend it all they want. Exactly. 
it's it's just it's just a new religion. It's new. It's new. A new church. It's new propaganda. You know, they're too busy calling everybody else religious and propaganda, yep. pro- propagandistic. They're too busy bitching about Fox News. Listen, I watched a freaking uh, a uh, a documentary on freaking Killzone, right? You know, it's again, it's not something big. Some some that some YouTuber did, and then he starts going to the fascist elements of the hell gas. I'm like, yeah, that's that's what happens when you get your freaking information from one source, you know. And he was wrong, you know. <laughs> They're trying to turn us against each other. That's They've been. What the media does. Yeah, because it's profitable. Exactly. I I hope it's facts. No, it's opinions. It's opinions. You know what? Don't if you take my word for it, don't. You know, fact check me. For one, I, I if I'm wrong, I want to be right. Make me right. You know. <laughs> oh, oh yeah, it's been very nice to meet you guys. But oh yeah, yeah. Enjoy. Friends now. I'll, I'll run into you again later. I'm gonna go do some adventuring before well, I as, as, sleep and wake up and go back to work. As a proviso, I have a hand, head injury and I have extreme difficulty making new memories, especially when it comes to people. So if I forget who you are, I, I have like 600 friends, so I have a lot of people I know in this game. So if I forget you, forgive me. <laughs> oh, you're good, man. Yeah. Uh, um. Yeah. All right. It was nice to meet hey. you, man. I'll remember you from uh, LeBlanc. It's my Persona mm-hmm. 5. Mm-hmm. All right. You know, adios. Mm-hmm. Enjoy. Yeah, that's, that's, it, man. that's a problem. People don't, people can't separate facts and opinions. You know, I take everything for a grain of salt. Mm-hmm. Also, check out the ceiling. You can't see that normally. But yeah, there's, people just can't do that. I mean, like, we got news media organizations, and they can't separate facts from opinions. They can't. You know, they like, it's, it's, it, some of it's just them being dumb. Some of it's, they just believe the lies they've been told. Some of them, they're just fucking lying. Okay. I've, I've, listen, I've been telling, I stopped watching the news freaking decades ago because of this. You can't trust these people. You couldn't trust them when I was young. You couldn't trust them when my parents mm-hmm. were young. It's just, I don't know. The lies are just getting more blinded though. And I say that, oh, you're just a freaking, you know, kooky redneck. No, no, this is, this is a thing. You know, they all lie to us. Fox News to us lies. <laughs> How do I play on VR? Um, I have a mixed reality VR headset. Um, I, 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 do you mean like uh, how are we playing streaming on VR? Or, you know, can, can you give me a little more details? Because I, I might answer this question like 30 different ways otherwise. I mean, specificity. That's what I need. A little bit of specificity. Oh, I guess I'm playing on VR right now. Oh, do I play VR games? Maybe, perhaps. I don't know. I own a lot of VR games, but none really interested me. I mean, yeah. But yeah, I do. I do play on VR. I mean, I I got hands. <laughs> you have an Oculus uh, Quest too. Oh, you can play this game. That person we were just talking to with the uh, that was a Southern accent, right? Um, he was playing with Quest, mm-hmm. but the Quest version of VR Chat is very limited. Like case in point, the avatar I have right now, you you wouldn't even be able to see. In fact, uh, because I have a fallback avatar, you'd see me as a brown-haired girl, actually, because I haven't said it right. Oh, okay, okay, cool. Uh, if you're asking what my name is, it's Noblin. I mean, if you want to join, I mean, that's up to you. Yeah. That's cool. Man, you got people coming to come see you. Yeah. Well, I, come see me. Swag. Swag I, right here. <laughs> I, 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 did, I did have one person join me, and I kind of expected by their tone of their voice that that found me over... What do I stream on? Twitch? I can't, I can't remember. I think it's Twitch. Um, yeah. And they came over here to troll me. You know, twelve girl syndrome. I. Uh, uh, it's just knob goblin. Troll, like, he, like, I got troll before. Like one time, playing the division, someone sent like thousands of bots to follow my channel. Oh my. So, I have no idea why. I, it, it's like I don't, I don't know why. Like. Like, it honestly, it annoyed me because, like, I thought, like, I was getting legit followers. Mm. And, like, they were turned out to be bots. I'm like, this is, like, this fucking sucks. Because 
There's a difference between there's a certain there's certain certain types of trauma that just sucks. Oh. I mean, like, some people just want to wreck other people's day because that he gets them off. You know, I just yeah. I don't know. Right. Some some people some people are just full of jealousy. I I I don't want to say like I'm all that impressive of a freaking man, but some people just get it. You know, are just jealous, or they they think that it's like oh I they, what's the word? Yeah. They just want to bring people down. You know, they see somebody like me that's like at least a little bit yeah. secure or whatever, or they're cooler than them. They just want listen. In real life, you can't walk up to that cool guy. You know, I, I'm, I'm just going to use a school analogy. You can't walk up to that cool guy in school because, well, he'll do what I would do to you and push your head into concrete. You know, but in a video game, this is a video game. I, I can't, I can't kick your ass in a video game. It'd be pointless for me to even to fucking talk about it outside of freaking, you know, talk about social issues. Exactly. Yeah. yeah. The only way you're going to work my day is trying to fucking get my IP address. Even mm -hmm. then, so what? Like, oh yeah, this is your name. This is where you live. I'm like, okay. Yeah. Come to me then. I. And then, and then they go silent. I, I mean, it's like I again. I, I've shown my face on cam. It's like I like I, I don't give a fuck. I just don't want people to know who I am because I don't want stalkers. I've I've been stalked before. You know that's scary shit. You know, I, um, maybe. You know, I mean, for a while, I would yeah, because of my really last job, I wasn't allowed to have a VPN. But I don't know. I've been I've been streaming with my freaking IP address out there. If somebody really wanted me. They probably already have my IP address already. I don't know. I don't. I don't think I pissed anybody off that much. You know, lately anyway. I mean, I don't want to be found. I don't want to be bothered. There's nothing impressive about me. I'm just a dude. You know? Yep. Like, honestly, like, me going that length to come at me is, like, kind of, like, a waste of fucking time. Like, you could be doing something so much better. I mean, I have set you to the point to where you try to come at me. And so you wasted your time to find my IP, do all that mm -hmm. stuff, and, and then, what? What do you want to do then? Come to me? All right, come to me then. I, I got fucking cops here to arrest you. <laughs> well, but yeah, yeah, come, come to my place. I'll bring, I'll, I'll pull out my gun. And it'll be self-defense. <laughs> I mean, well, I mean, it's like I'm not, I'm not afraid of other men or, or women in my case, you know, because I've been stopped by women. Yes. But it's, it's just that cringe factor, that violation for me. You know what I mean? I, I value my privacy. I really do. You know. I mean, I'm, 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 you know, fairly good looking. I'm decent looking, okay, and I'm interesting. So that's a bad combination for some people, you know. That's whatever. <laughs> I, I don't know. I just, yeah. But I, I, I have. Cons if I ever make it big, maybe I'll invest in a VPN. I don't know. I mean. Yeah, I mean, it's so easy. Somebody actually told me my my email address at one point. I mean, you can easily find it via a client. You know, you could find somebody's IP address, dude. You get a, you, you download a client in this game. You get one of those modded clients. You can find out my IP address easy. You just a lot, plenty of people know 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 where I live. You know, it's just question is is how accurate are those information in you know, a freaking nice redneck freaking ISP? I mean, I just I just don't want people bothering me, man. I I don't. That's it. Exactly. You know the the the, yeah, the, like, the Google Maps truck passed by my house like a month ago when I was outside. I, uh, I was dressed down and everything. I had my hair was a mess. I have long hair. My hair was a mess. And there it comes, there there it is, Google Maps passing right by my fucking house. I'm like, well, this is where we're at. I just fucking flipped them off. <laughs> I'm just out there <laughs> waiting waiting for a school bus, you know? <laughs> school oh yeah, New York. Oh, yeah. yeah, yeah, just just you know, look looking at freaking anime or whatever. Hi, hello, hello. What's up? Oh, not yeah, much. I, I knew about that Google truck. I was in it, my guy. You're in it. Oh, nice. I, I, I didn't really, I didn't really appreciate you flipping me off there. Oh, I'm so, it was listen, mean. Listen, it was to my supervisor. It was, it was a message <laughs> to the man. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, okay, I understand. I'm... Yeah, yeah. <laughs> listen, listen, listen. When, when the revolution comes and we, we throw a freaking uh, a brick to your house or through your business, you know, where you work, you flip burgers, or in your case, you flip Googles. You know, it's it's not personal. When, when we Googles. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> we, we're, we, it's nothing personal, okay? We're just going to... Oh, yeah, right. you know, or you're, you're driving a truck full of Googles, you know? It's fine. It's okay. It's nothing personal. It's it's We're just going to beat you senselessly and steal your shit, Okay. 
a revolution, motherfucker, because we care about people. It's just, it's, it's nothing personal. We, we yeah. care about people. It's nothing personal. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Power to the people, except the people driving trucks. Oh my. Yeah, it's just, um, people just don't, I don't know. Just fucking leave people alone, man. But people are so, our society has become so butthurt, you know? And I'm not saying, like, it's I've true. never been butthurt. I'm, yeah, it's not like I've never been butthurt in my life. Okay, I've been butthurt a couple of times. It happens, you know? It's not about being butthurt. It's about t taking everything like you're taking a cactus up the ass. Oh, yeah. You know? <laughs> like, come on. Oh, I got, I got, some, I got some, I got some uh, videos I can show you. I'm not going to, by the way. <laughs> yeah. So some, some, there's, don't, there, don't there's, there's, pe there's people out there that, that, you know, maybe perhaps taking a cactus up the, up the, up the uh, posterior, is maybe perhaps desirable for some reason. And yeah. Most people would like to lodge entire jars up their assholes. So I mean. Yeah. What you know what. Listen, mm. check the structural integrity of your mason jars. More yeah, importantly, fill them full of sand. <laughs> <laughs> you know? Just in case. <laughs> yeah, listen, it's it's a little thing I learned from pipe ending, you know? It is you don't want your pipe to crinkle. It's just fill it full of sand. Or frozen soapy water. You know, then it doesn't doesn't collapse <laughs> when you bend it. <laughs> Shit. I grabbed, I grabbed curry, but uh, I don't have legs. Uh, I dropped it. It's okay. Well, because you're a quest user, we can't see your curry. We can we can only see our stuff. Yeah, it's like we live in a different universe. Well, you got sad cack. Yeah, yeah. It's just the way it is. I I don't know if it's because oh, of I the see. engine or if it's because of how Kirisu made the world. <laughs> I don't know. Honestly, there's like it's the same thing for like the feeder system. There's only like one feeder experience that even works for quest. You know. <laughs> Mm. Things like that. It's just not adapted fully yet. I mean, it's I, like avatars. We can't see like uh, any, anything above ten megabytes or rated below uh, poor. <laughs> or I, five thousand polygons. <laughs> I mean, I, I I have considered you know making making quest avatars, but there's so many goddamn freaking effects. That I like to use, like the like I'm wearing glasses, and I like the fact that I, the way the way that uh, G, uh, who made this one spam, the way spam made these. If I'm far enough away from you, these things light up, and I like that. I fucking like that effect, but you can't yeah. do that. I mean, if I wanted to do transparency with you these, can't do that on here. Yeah, if if I wanted just the simple transparent illusion of wearing glasses, I would just simply just remove the geometry in the first place because Quest can't do transparency. Just give Quest transparencies, people. <laughs> Quest is fine. It's the problem is the fact that the standalone is like this. I mean, it's still a headset that you can directly plug into your PC and it'll function mm -hmm. like any other headset. So I mean, we won't. I won't be blocking avatars that way. I just got my Quest like two days ago though, so I haven't had a chance to get the cord mm -hmm. to uh, actually better off, off my processing power. Well, so I'm limited. Do you have a standalone bullshit? Do you have a newer, <laughs> say, Wi-Fi six router? Because apparently there's a uh, desktop remote. There's a, basically you can have a desktop VR or sorry, PC VR via. No, no, yeah, the, I know that. Wireless I, I, I've seen that. They okay. just put that into the experimental. Uh, yeah, my Wi-Fi won't do that. I mean, I got huh. really good Wi-Fi. I got like fucking gigabyte a second Wi-Fi, but the router I got don't doesn't do that. I don't oh, got I any see. XM6 or shit. So. Oh, I see. Routers fucking. I mean. Suck. <laughs> I, 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 I do, I do, uh, on the lark, I do uh, criticize, freaking, I like to make fun of people that have Quest headsets, I really do, but it, I get it, it's a, it's it's easy to get See, into, not not everybody has a powerful computer, so it's like, what's it's what's no, the investment with VR? I, like, haven't had, mm -hmm. for me, it's not that I haven't had a powerful computer, I couldn't afford a better headset, it's about the portability factor mm -hmm. that I want something on standalone, something that on like a nice day. If it's hot, I can go outside and still use it, you know, oh. as and I also have the option to plug it into the PC. So I just have the same amount of power there. Uh, yeah, but I don't know, like compared to like a Vive or something, I think it 
it's like honestly better just in terms of uh controls not in terms mm -hmm. of power mm -hmm. you know well for but me the controllers are nice on the quest that's all i can get i mean it's, it, do, it does have a really cool <laughs> nice feature you know the uh the built-in finger tracking and I, I i know it's hacky but that that would be it's in spit experimental yeah, yeah but it's there it's really cool i can't wait for that to come out of yeah. experimental but i mean personally though I, I i want i want a vr headset that has finger tracking and every time i start looking at the external options with my vr headset it's like i may as well buy an index but i'm waiting for the next generation vr headsets with finger tracking i'm waiting for those exactly. right, there's no point in like worrying about the current gen because we're mm -hmm. still in a prototype generation no matter how mainstream it is we don't have fucking vr mmos yet we don't got fucking anything that's caused mass support because the only type of support we've gotten is support appealing to base consumers that's it mm -hmm. there's no vr audience built completely yet to start making that stuff oh yeah it's only a generally a handful of vr users and every like bit <laughs> like it's <laughs> out there but it's not yeah, a mainstream yeah. technology yet yeah yeah we, we'll get there <laughs> we'll get there we'll get there give it 10 years <laughs> yeah so it's like yeah i'm not worried about they what do next you have vr mmos into work though yeah i've uh, there's one oh, but i'm not i'm those? not really impressed with the, at, the one uh, i saw what's, what's it called pressed but like uh, uh i was looking at one zenith I'm not impressed by it, but like for entry level MMO adaptations, like it looks pretty good, you know? Yeah. I mean, like, I've seen it. It's got climbing, which is, I guess, got, I guess a must have. I mean, you know what? Just, yeah, you know what? That is a you must have. You gotta start somewhere, you know? I mean, if they put if they put the finger tracking in there, it looks cool being able to use, like, magic mixing that mm -hmm. and stuff. They're putting it in alpha soon, next month or the month after. So they, they have plenty of work to experiment with that genre. I think that, genre. I think that we're going to see a, that's where, convergent evolution of control schemes with VR. You know, we're already seeing it in our physical controllers. True. You know? So, I mean, I th I think all the games are going to be the same, you know. Uh, you know, it's just it's just a different play like style. Eventually, it's going to go all towards the hand tracking system, mm -hmm. but it's going to need like reliable sensors in every headset that's modernized, mm -hmm. which is going to also cap users from using uh, older games like, well, not like VR Chat. VR Chat's pretty open source; you can customize a lot inside of it. So. I mean, I but I like played games like I play. You mean like de, you mean like desktop games? It's like personally, I played uh, desktop yeah. games in VR, and it's not very enjoyable. I I would prefer screens. You know, I got no. multiple screens anyway. Um, it's not really exactly. much more immersive for me. Um, they, then again, I'm also a guy that I would rather build a DOS computer to play a DOS game versus run it in DOS box. You know, but then again, I also have the hardware to do that. Mm -hmm. I mean, I can mm -hmm. I can build a Windows XP LAN with gaming grade parts and in, in freaking it's not that hard. I got the I got the parts to do it. No, it's really not. Yeah, but you know, for, I imagine for a lot of other people, it's like you know that big screen experience. I mean, I have a, a freaking full HD projector. I have screens like if I really want to play a big screen freaking experience, I can do it. It's not that hard. You know, this is this would be less that. for me. That. You know. I mean, yeah, there's the convenience. Right. This I can is look honestly, putting on a VR headset's more work than fucking mm -hmm. like throwing on a projector or something. Realistically, oh, yeah. just turn it on your computer screen. It's like shit. Fucking this shit, you got to put on your fucking headsets, <laughs> headphones, whatever the fuck else you goddamn need. Work with your avatars, make it how you want it. You know, at home before you can even mm -hmm. be there. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. But I mean, it's just so much easier to do stuff physically. Yeah, so I, I think I think I will uh, always have the 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 two D screen experience, you know, when it comes to that uh, portability. That's not really an option for me, by the way, when it comes to you see the Quest. I mean, I, I I can afford a Quest, like I said, but I'd rather not. I mean, that's not even an option for me. You know, it's it would basically be a waste of money yeah. for me. For me, it's only an option because I'm using a laptop that is capable to run baseline, <laughs> not baseline, but like mid above baseline VR, mm -hmm. and then I don't have the space to set up base stations. That is the only reason I opted for a quest is because mm -hmm. the onboard sensors that have the guardian perimeter built in. The guardian perimeter is the best, single best feature on the quest. It is better than almost any other external detection feature from the light boxes 
boxes or anything because of how the grid set up and how you draw and set up your grid. Mm -hmm. You know. Oh, for that's, me, I I know my space. One, one big up. Yeah, exactly. But that that's another thing. It's like it detects objects on the spot as to where like other systems they expect you to have your area completely uh -huh. clear and don't have objects in the way. Or if you, you have know. a girlfriend, if you have a girlfriend that likes to touch your dick while you're playing VR chat. <laughs> <laughs> It'd be like it's for the immersion, bro. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's like oh, I got, I got, I got a rig room. You know, I, I used to play upstairs in my my old office. You know, and I did, I basically had enough room that I could scoot around because I, I'm, I'm, I, I tinker a lot, so my office was atrocious. Now I got to, I'm doing the same damn thing to my office. I, I can't, I can't put base stations and everything. I, I can do that if I want, but I don't have the headset that supports that in the first place. There's no point. I, I like the inside out tracking that I have. Mm. You know, I'm cool with it. The problem is, is I can't track behind my head. I think I definitely will my next VR headset. Mm, that's I, true. I want one that definitely supports outside tracking too. Base stations. They I definitely should, need something yeah, like that. They should. Uh... There's a Chinese headset actually that's yeah, standalone. Honestly. The Neos and the Neos yeah. uh, two and three that has magnetic tracking that can track behind your head. You know, remember the Razer that's, Hydra? That's weird. I was just thinking like. It's kind of yeah, like that. Yeah, I Hydra. Yeah, it's kind of like that, cool. except built in a VR headset. Cool. So it, it it uses optical tracking, so that's your highest resolution, you know. But then you put it behind your head, and it still knows where you know if you're trying to touch your ass and the like, you know. So that is interesting. But the thing uh, about <laughs> magnetic tracking is, <laughs> is, is I imagine if you got two headsets in the same space, well, it's essentially the Chi a Chinese or t maybe Taiwanese equivalent of the Quest. It's a standalone VR headset, you know. It's it's literally mm. built for business. It's like six hundred, seven hundred dollars. Okay, go to bed. Enjoy. Oh, you know, sweet. <laughs> I, I guess I I don't I don't. Here, Mwah. there's your good night kiss. <laughs> <laughs> Bye. <laughs> if you can't tell, I'm a really secure man. <laughs> <laughs> it's all good, bro. It's all good. <laughs> but yeah. Uh... Honestly, I, I, though, like for other standalone headsets, couldn't they just install sensors into the back of like the head strap? If say on the Quest Two, they didn't remove the hmm. uh, good fucking head strap, because that's the main thing I hate about this headset compared to the original Quest. Because I didn't buy it, but I saw it. Was mm -hmm. they got rid of the plastic like back support head strap and gave it the stupid ass three point like bicycle strap? You know? Oh, yeah. You so said the 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 the. It puts a lot of pressure on like the the frontal lobe of your brain you I, know <laughs> i don't i don't like the strap ones i like i like the halo sets you know i like i like yeah, the, the click yeah, ones exactly, I, I that's exactly. one of the reasons i like the mixed reality headsets so goddamn much you know because because they're so comfortable to me i i have a, a 20 dollar vr headset i bought at walmart and i say when i say vr headset i mean it's a real v it's not something i stick my phone in it's an actual vr headset it has all tracking abilities it just can't it just can't lean you know, and it doesn't have controllers for the hands. But you can make that happen. My hands are fucking up. I don't barely have controllers as it were. But, um, you know, <laughs> but it, it has that spongy. You see, I got very fine, long hair, you know, and it just doesn't stay on my head. And it's so uncomfortable. And it bunches my hair up. The halos on the hand, not a fucking I get, problem. I like it, though. I, I actually took, I, I have a broken VR headset. It, you know, it's, it's a spare one. It's, and I just took the halo off of it and mm. I put it on that $20 headset. And I'm thinking about giving it to one of my damn kids. <laughs> except the oh, fact well, that, it works, man. <laughs> except the fact that this thing only has 60 hertz tracking and everybody in my family, except me, is motion, has motion sickness. I am absolutely new to I it. I feel that, bro. Yeah, $20 what VR headset, the, uh, man. I don't even know if fucking Quest 2 is running in 90 hertz or 120 right now if they fucking finish that upscale push out. 90 right now? Okay, yeah. So I thought I know they were gonna I know they were gonna do 120 soon. So <laughs> it's weird that they can uh, push out the fucking hertz upscale. You know? Just uh just on a live update for the headset alone. But I guess it makes sense, whatever. Yeah. You'd think they'd be restricted by their own onboard tech but it just shows they didn't utilize it all yet well i mean yeah it's that's actually pretty cool you, you're getting soft optimizations you know you, you you're getting more functionality you know you, you don't have to buy new that's that's Facebook okay it's like using it as like an experimental thing they're like beta testing mm -hmm. users on in a 
official release. <laughs> Hi. Like they do with normal fucking games now. Hi. I just I just want to say, Cookie, you look absolutely fucking adorable. <laughs> I mean, I'm usually just nonplus with these these uh, monkey avatars, but actually, this is the best one I've ever. A chimpanzee. This is the best one I've ever seen. So you know, bravo. <laughs> Yeah, well, like I said, I, it's like I, I just want finger tracking and maybe some kind of base hip tracking because, like I said, I'm tired. Oh, I guess you didn't hear me say it. I am tired yeah. of leaning over something and then shooting up because my head is over it. I don't like that. I I need something. I just I, want the yeah, hip and leg tracking, too. Hip, leg, upper body seems, like, fine, but, like, the rear mm -hmm. tracking, like you said, and then, like, hip and, like, leg. Ankle sensors are on it. Obviously, like one of the ways to go, but mm -hmm. then again, it's kind of invasive, I guess. Not invasive, but like, uh, I don't know. I guess you feel like you're on house arrest when you win VR chat. <laughs> <laughs> I, I've i never been on house arrest before, so I wouldn't know. Me neither, bro. Me neither. <laughs> I've known people, though. <laughs> uh -huh. I mean, where I live, uh, they don't even bother with that, you know. It's you getting country boy. <laughs> <laughs> they just Fair they enough. just arrest Fair you and, and then you know maybe maybe give you a trial trial at some point maybe someday <laughs> yeah someday <laughs> mm. some ah oh, it's good rob fuck yeah mango by the way ah, it's feeding the addiction i mean one of my they got they get they have a phone app and they just came out with uh, uh, another phone app from for Deca, which is supposed to emulate their their hardware Deca gear for free. Um, I haven't tried it out myself, but uh, my cousin tries it out and she, and I watched her use it and she can like roll her hips around, you know. It's kind of cool. It's a tiny bit janky when you actually, actually see it cool. on her side, but by the time it translates. You know, to you because they smooth out the uh, they smooth out the 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 movement frames for other people seeing you. It, it looks very smooth. You know, you can watch her wiggle her hips. You know, whatever. It's just nice. That's cool. That's <laughs> yeah, it's pretty, pretty cool. It it it, especially it, it kind of guesses your geo position by ma magnetism it is mostly like an orientation thing but it's it was good enough that she can lean over without okay my whole body just moved over but all i did was move my freaking head over my shoulder you know i'm not moving my hips at all but you see me move yeah, well i get that yeah well you can literally lean over you know to a degree anyways because yeah, it guesses a, you can like actually bend and like in mm -hmm. place and stuff too the thing is, like the locomotion in this is janky, mm -hmm. just in general. That for me would be good enough. Motion is fucked. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, yeah. With the deck of gear, yeah, the locomotion changes. Where like if I'm walking, it's just I'm gonna back up for demonstration. And I look this way, and I'm, I, I walk. I literally walk where I am looking, and the deck of gear solves that. And a lot of people say it's more natural. It's like yeah, I would agree. I would. I would agree with that. That's what I want. That's one of the reasons I wanted the deck gear. Exactly. I was, I just wasn't sure. I just wasn't fucking sure. I should have been brave. Now I'm locked out of the four hundred dollars. It probably cost me like seven hundred fucking dollars. But, but for what it has, maybe I'll pay for seven hundred freaking dollars. But give me external tracking options. Listen, Microsoft. Listen, Microsoft. Give me Microsoft. fucking connect fucking tracking. It's not fucking hard. <laughs> this is your hardware i own three connects with freaking the cables okay just give me the ability to fucking track my shit behind my head it's not fucking hard just fucking do it also <laughs> <laughs> i don't even want skeleton track i don't even want skeleton tracking just just give me freaking optical tracking <laughs> Please, for the love of fucking God, give me optical track. Yeah, yeah, it's. A, I got it mounted. It's right there. Uh, yeah, for some reason, I can't point. I got. I got it. It's right there. It's mounted. Go into that field. Yeah. Like, the 
supposed to be okay with this dragon. So, like, Microsoft could make, uh, could do stuff with virtual reality. They could. Mm -hmm. They could. Problem with Kinect is, like, it didn't blow up as much because of the games they kept putting out. <laughs> you know what? They didn't put out any fucking good titles for they... Connect. Okay, okay. They put out okay. a couple, a couple there is... like decent titles. There is one game. It the game is decent. It's not the game that's shitty. It's the Connect it shitty, right? But I would love this game ported to VR. It's called freaking Steel Battalion, Heavy Armor, or Heavy Assault, or whatever it's called. And it was it was a Connect release title, and it was it it looks oh. like a really good game. And it's like, okay, fuck the Connect. Just give me VR ability to freaking... It, the game's already there. The script's already there. The textures, the model, the physics. Just give me VR controls so I can reach up and interact with you. Give me VR controls. Make that... Port that motherfucker to the Quest. I will buy a fucking Quest. That's how... You want me... You, you want me to buy a fucking Quest? That's how you fucking do it. You pour freaking goddamn... Steel Battalion, a freaking quest. That's the only way to do it. But the thing is, God hold on, hold the phone, hold the phone. <laughs> Steel up. Battalion, which is made by From Software, uh, but it's a Mark, it's it, it's 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 a Microsoft fucking game. Microsoft already owns the fucking rights to it. You see where I'm getting at here, right? Microsoft, fucking make a VR fucking version of it. You have the shit. We have the technology. Make it fucking happen. It's a it's a goddamn Xbox. It's an it's an Xbox 360 game. My computer can emulate it. If there's any point that they need to port game, older games into VR, it's now before VR adapts to a point where it starts getting high res. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Because then they're gonna have to do a whole lot more work. <laughs> <laughs> I mean. Just do it now. God, I kind of, I kind, I kind of, I kind of want to hook my old, my old, old Xbox back up, and I want to get on. E Fuck it, I'm looking up still. You know what? I want to. You know, this will piss you off, right? I, I, I was a Marine a lot in, in the in the early 2000s and in, in late 90s, right? And um, I bought. I was, I was at, I was at this electronic store called Fry's, and I was thinking, do I spend four hundred dollars on my 3D? You know, mod, it's modeling software like Blender, except cost it's cost money Blender. Right, or do I buy Steel Battalion, mm -hmm. which it just came out? I'm like, hmm, Maya, Steel Battalion. Imagine how good I'd be if I was modeling for the last fucking 20 years instead of the fucking the last two years. But anyway, so I decided to buy Steel Battalion instead. It's two hundred dollars. <laughs> so I, I I got this box. This huge comes. It's listen. Steel Battalion is an ex, an OG Xbox game, like the the big black one that you can kill somebody with, right? Yeah, I, 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 you know. So. It's 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 it comes with it comes in a huge yeah it it comes in a box a big box and it's got a forty two button control with three joysticks and fucking three goddamn pedals. it's got a fucking clutch okay well it's got two joysticks it's got a fucking shift right it's got a it's it's this is, it's one of it's it's one it's the only game that uses this control it's forty two fucking button controller it's got a fucking if you don't eject the game deletes your saves okay this is a fucking almost nerdy it's by the same company that made um. That made uh, Armor Core uh, from, I think. But um, anyway, so I bought this game. I, I hadn't even opened the box yet. I, 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 and of course, you know, I went to work, came home the next day because, you know, whatever, I'm a busy dude. I, I fucking do shit. And, and then I was, I was about to open this motherfucker. I was like, yes, you know. And I got a call, you know, and then I went away for two years. <laughs> I so I I, I, I got, bought Steel Battalion. Well, okay, okay. I, so I I I, so I, I, I had I had like I had a week to pack up my entire apartment, my entire life, put it in storage, right? There's the key word here, storage, right? And I left for two years. Storage. I surrendered my apartment, you know, you know, because 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 I'm I'm military, or at the time I was military, I I can get out of contracts. Else. Yeah. So <laughs> so I was gone for two years, came back. By the way, I was paying for this storage for the whole fucking time. They were still charging me. And it turns out they auctioned my shit off. They auctioned your shit off while still charging you? That's yeah. actually fucked. Oh, I sued them. <laughs> but I lost, like, things I will never God get damn. back again. I lost things I will never... I lost things I've literally killed for. You know? And that's shitty. And But most importantly, I never got to play fucking... I lost 
thousand dollar radios. I lost freaking antique computers. I lost pictures. I lost. I lost the girlfriend's anime doll collection. He lost Steel Battalion. I lost. More importantly, I lost Steel lost fucking Steel Battalion. Battalion I lost my huge lost game Steel collection, but I lost Steel it's fucking okay. Battalion, and I can't find the fucking game anymore. There's a hole in my life. No. No. And those assholes still we charge me. That fucking arcade cabinet, dude. Yeah, those assholes still, still charge fucking charge me. Like that, bro. Holy fucking shit. <laughs> God damn. Like, fuck them. Yeah, Steel Battalion, man. I, I need to get that. I need, I need yeah. Steel Battalion in my life. It's one of those few games that sells but, way more than what it used to sell. True, and that's that's where we come back to our point here. Fuck uh -huh. Google. You know, <laughs> fuck Google. Yeah, fuck Google. <laughs> Take a picture of me, freaking unshaven, freaking just hair everywhere. Oh, I look like I crawled well, out of the fucking Stone same Age. Of my taint on Google. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, my, my phone's about, to, listen, my, my phone is about to die. And so this is the point I got to cut it off. I stream from my phone, by the way, and I haven't bought the adapter to charge my phone and stream at the same time. So this is goodbye. Oh no. Bye. I got to oh, cut it. <laughs> listen, I love you. It's okay. <laughs> I'm, I'm, listen, it's okay. I'm compensating dating freaking my audience, no. America. <laughs> <laughs> Bye. Glory.